Hello there, all you beautiful thrill seekers. My name is Ghost Shadow Stubborn, but built for theme parks, and welcome to Ghost Chat YouTube channel. <laughs> Hello there, guys. My name is Ghost Shadow Stubborn, but built for theme parks, and welcome to a theme park newsroom update. Well, well technically, it's a newsroom. It's not really a newsroom update because this is a reacts video, uh, but it's kind of technically a news update as well because. Um, we've got something to react to today. We, we've got something to react to, and it's basically the Tornado Springs advert. Now, this reaction video is absolutely critical uh, for, for Tornado Springs. It's an incredible advert. I'm sure it was going to be brilliant. Uh, I haven't watched it yet, but I've heard some reviews from people saying it is brilliant. Uh, and I can't wait to see this advert for myself. I can't wait to analyse the advert. So as usual with the reaction videos, I did record the uh, re uh, Coast Child Reacts to Lessons from My Neighbourhood, which is a very specific uh, target market video. Um, hopefully that should be up in the next few days. Uh, but with that one, what I did was I, wait, I watched in each... Uh, excuse me, each clip and then analysed it afterwards so there's no pausing in between. So what we're going to do is, we're going to play the advert and then I'm going to analyse my thoughts afterwards. So, before we get started with all of that, go guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, click the OK spell so you never miss another YouTube video. Make sure you go into the description down below where not only can you find the links to Poulton's Park's YouTube channel and also the link to the video itself so you guys can watch it for yourselves, you can also check in the description down below where you can find links to the Google Forms where you can submit your video ideas. If you've got an idea for a next five years video, a review, a closed but not forgotten video, a fact file, a future plan, or a reaction video, theme park or non-theme park, get it in the Google Forms link and we'll save all your video ideas. And in the summer, we're going to be literally going through every single one of them and absolutely going to town on these ideas and absolutely processing them one by one and pre-recording them one by one. Also, guys, make sure you go in the description down below where you can find links to Twitter, TikTok, Instagram, Snapchat, and also the Discord server where you, yes, you, the Coast Child fan base, can be involved with the channel and the fan base and interact with me and every other fan. And for now, guys, before we analyse the advert, let's have a watch of it, shall we? When the first one happened, we didn't know what the heck was going on. It got dark, real dark, you know, like end of the world dark. Of course, they're alive, Bill. When you live with it, you're dead. We got some of the brightest and bravest in the business here protecting our town. No matter what Mother Nature throws at us. And what would Tornado Springs be if it weren't for a few tornadoes? We come from a long line of storm chasers. Far back as anyone can remember, the storm's been on our blood. Here in Tornado Springs, Twister's come to you. Cindy and Coop Jr. have been training from a real young age. I guess it just made sense our kids would follow the family tradition. We build these here machines, some to get us closer to the storm, some so we can feel their forces. We train for every conceivable eventuality. It's hard work, but we keep them strong. We believe there's a storm chaser inside each one of you. So come on, storm chasers, join the adventure. Here in Tornado Springs, only at Paltons Park. So that was the Paltons Park Tornado Springs advert. It says it's opening on the 19th of March. That's a very, very ambitious opening date. Um, I know I've seen on Twitter about Blackpool Pleasure Beach. I know a lot of people have been getting emails saying that they've sort of been requested to, you know, they've been advised to book, you know, in March or at the end of March. So, you know, that's what Pleasure Beach are expected to be opening by. It'd be interesting to see if they do open by then. It'd be great to get down there for the first day of the season if it is going to be the end of March. Um, but obviously, Tornado Springs, Poulton's Park, big, big area. We've covered this on the channel for about a year and a half, nearly two years now. And we've covered this right from the start. We covered it from the first teaser poster. We, you know, old classic fans of Poulton's Park will remember the days when the area was basically grassland. It was basically the way you had the Waves Runner, which opened back in like, what, 2007. And in the site, you had like an old, like a combination of a mini golf and panning for gold western themed attraction. 
um, I think it's like Gold Rush Falls or something like that. And then you also had like an, uh, some old animal enclosures, like the old pelicans and flamingo enclosures. Of course, they've been relocated to a different area of the park, and the old cages which hold the or, or the old enclosures which hold the animals have been demolished, along with the Panning for Gold attraction. And to, the fact that a Panning for Gold attraction, a little mini golf themed to the Wild West as well. And a couple of old animal enclosures, as well as a re-theme of like the tractors, the train, and the wave runner. Apart from the re-themes, the attractions have all been replaced with this brand new massive area with a max spinning coaster, a swing ride, family drop towers, a driving school. It's just it's mad. It's absolutely mad. And that's taking into that's not taking into account a few play areas, the restaurant, the shop, the re-theme of the tractors, the re-theme of the train around the area, and also the re-theme of the wave run into Buffalo Falls. So obviously Storm Chase is gonna be the highlight signature attraction for the thrill seekers, but there are other amazing attractions. And to be fair, actually the Panning for Gold attraction was specifically replaced by the driving school. So where the driving school is is where the uh, old mini golf and panning for gold Wild West attractions were uh, beforehand. Uh, I think the animal enclosures were like opposite or like next to each other as well. So I think they've been replaced by this driving school as well. Uh, but the rest of it's grassland, the rest of it's on grassland, and of course we've seen the stuff uh, from behind the fence of Tornado Springs with the with the other coaster track, rumours of a, a Duplo uh, Dino Express type coaster by Matt Rides uh, themed to Tornado Springs coming in 2022. I mean we'll keep tabs on the construction of that for you guys when we get more stuff from that. But I'm really excited for Tornado Springs. I think it's a wonderful area. I think the Poulton's Park have done an incredible job. Speaking with the advert then, uh, I love the concept of the advert. And I think that the overall idea of the advert, sort of, you know, trending up the next generation to uh, look out for those storms and chase down the tornadoes. Um, very good, very cool idea, very good idea. I can see why people, I did look at reviews after watching the advert before I started recording this bit and I sort of looked at reviews and people were like, it say on social media, it is a little bit green screeny and I can kind of see that in a way, but you know, what else could they have done? You know, could they have, got, unless they were a proper, unless they cast a proper family of four in their own house bubble. Uh, where they could be together in their own sort of uh, green screen and they don't have to social distance if they're in separate bubbles. Um, you know, they're fair enough. But in, in places, you know, people could see why it looks a little bit green screeny. But I'm not going to complain because it looks amazing. The rise and attractions look incredible. You can see the paintwork being done on all the rise and attractions, the cars on the driving school, uh, the, the sort of restraints and the whole system of the swing ride, the cyclinator. Uh, the look of the windmill towers, the storm chaser. And uh, I just saw a video actually this morning on Twitter and the Tornado Springs Storm Chaser coaster has been testing. So make sure you go on Twitter and check that out. But someone actually filmed a video with people, I guess it was like staff members on it. And uh, they were testing the row with bodies on the, tra on the, on the, the train, uh, on the cars. So, um, you know, fair play for, for testing this ride with people on ready for the opening in March. If there is going to be a 19th of opening in March, which is looking likely to be. Um, obviously, you know, in terms of getting down there to the opening day, it's very 50-50 with the restrictions and everything. And of course, you know, once we get out of this lockdown, it is going to be probably back into tier systems. So I don't think I'll be down there for the opening day of this. But you know what? I, I think this is going to still going to be a wonderful addition. And I'll get down there as soon as restrictions allow uh, to experience this new area because I think the the theme of this whole area is incredible the advert shows off the best of this area the acting quality by the way amazing you know you know what's what's you know Tornado Springs is not Tornado Springs without a little tornadoes um brilliant acting quality massive shout out to the team at Poulton's Park we, we've interacted with Poulton's Park a lot on this channel um you know Poulton's Park are a fan of the videos you know the engineering team got a shout out in an earlier update about a year or so ago and, you know, Poulton's Park have been a huge fan of these updates. So, you know, off, off their enthusiasm for the project and my enthusiasm for the project and everyone else's enthusiasm for the project, we kept pushing on with these updates and we kept pushing on with them. And, you know, it's got to the stage now where we're only a few weeks away from the opening of this, at this new area, like a month or so away from the opening of this brand new area. And I really can't wait to see what's going to happen with this area once it's fully open, once it's fully operational, once it's completely and utterly up and running. Really can't wait for this. And, you know, massive shout out to the, the people that created the advert for Tornado Springs because they've done a wonderful job getting the gist of it right, getting the family thrill aspect of it correct. And uh, overall, 
couldn't fault it. So thank you very much, guys, for watching my reaction to the Tornado Springs advert. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And for now, guys, my name is Coach Chell. Keep living the coast of life. And I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have a potent-tastic day.